Uh, so that was pretty easy. Let's say get out of the cheat when <laughs> I miss the buggy. That should count. It didn't count. Oh my god. I guess I can try to run the heavy over. Oh. Oh. What was that? Soldier. Wow. Okay. Got them. Just need to do it one more time. And I guess I shot that man through the wall. <laughs> Hello everyone, Frank Tastic here and welcome back to Ghost Recon Breakpoint. In this video I am attempting to do Panther Class Challenges Rank 16. Uh, and I just gotta say, looking at the Rank Up Challenges, they seem pretty stupid. These challenges are stupid. They have nothing to do with stealth or ghost recon or anything like that. The first one is kill two enemies with mines, then one with CQC in eight seconds. Okay. Uh, second one is run four enemies over with a vehicle without getting detected. And the last one is run an enemy over with a vehicle, then quickly kill another one with CQC. So who came up with these challenges? I want to know. I want to know who came up with these challenges so I can just punch them in the face because, my God, they are retorted. Honestly, if these challenges did not have any type of reward or didn't have any type of cosmetic reward or weapon blueprint, I wouldn't even care to do them. I would stay at, like, rank 10 and just do that. But I do like the cosmetics, and there are some weapon blueprints for some of the rewards. So, yeah, I'm going to try to do some of these challenges. Anyways, the first one is kill two enemies with mines, then one with CQC in eight seconds. All right, so it doesn't tell me a very specific place, so I can do that anywhere. And I am, I have decided to do the Kelso Fields because, honestly, there's a lot of foot traffic on along these roads and in these fields. So I think this is a, the best place probably to do vehicle stuff like this. But two enemies with mines and one with CQC. Okay. I actually have a very interesting idea for this. I don't know how well it will work. But hopefully it works well enough. Two enemies with mines and one with CQC. Which means I need three people. And it looks like there's three right over here. Because there's these two. And then there's these. Is this three people? Yeah, this is three people. Yeah, nothing but quiet over here too, dude. No, we got no tangos in sight. Place the mine right here. Shit, that didn't sound right. Where the hell did that come from? Cool, let's go. Nothing happening here. I'll keep looking. Uh, so that was pretty easy. <laughs> Actually took just one try. Wow. Am I just that good, brother? Because I think I am. So there's these two nerds. Um, is there a vehicle around here? I know I spawned a vehicle, but it's like way over there. Vehicle's passing by. I don't know if there's a vehicle like actually here. Uh, so what I can probably do, run an enemy over with a vehicle, then quickly kill another with CQC. I don't know, when it says quickly kill another with CQC, oh by the way, I don't think I've showed it yet, I am playing 
um, elite tactical settings and um, extreme settings elite and elite that is all I play I never change the settings but I do show it just in case people question anyways so this man it's right here okay that man actually went pretty far away I need to come over here and get my vehicle so I only need two people. So the one I'm going for is run and need me over with the vehicle, then quickly kill another CQC. That's what I'm trying to go for here. I gotta time this right though. Get out of the fucking jeep. I said get out of the jeep, but I missed the buggy. That should count. It didn't count. Are you are you kidding? That didn't count? I ran one over, then I knifed the man as fast as I could. The only thing that took so long was getting out of the vehicle. Hmm. Maybe that vehicle is not the best because it did take a lot longer than I wanted for him to uh, get out. And I know I could, like, drive a bit faster so he, like, dives out, but that still takes a long time. Maybe just the simple truck with a door. And yeah, maybe this truck. Maybe it's actually faster to get in and out of this truck compared to that buggy. Okay, so run some whatever, break, and get out. Eh, it's a bit faster. So run an enemy over with a vehicle, then quickly kill another. Maybe the buggy doesn't count as a vehicle. That'd be weird. I am looking for people on the road. There's some over here. Uh, I don't know. There's people standing right over there. I don't know if those are enemies or not. Yeah, there's an enemy right here. I want to clear these people over here. Oh my god. I am playing extreme settings, I am telling you. These people... Uh, shit. Uh, yeah, extreme. Maybe it's... Uh, I think it's because I am Panther. Panther is a stealth class, and I'm using Slim Shadow, and it's nighttime, so I'm technically in the, sh in the shadow. So, with all that combined, it actually makes the, it harder for the enemy to detect you. Alright, I don't know how well this is going to work. Don't show him an ounce of mercy. Get out of the vehicle. There we go. I guess maybe the buggy didn't count. Who knows? But this one is run four enemies over with a vehicle without getting detected. So far, these challenges, even though they are just crazy and stupid, they're still pretty easy. Or I'm just really good. Either one. It's not that hard. There's my buggy. But I need to find four enemies, and I gotta run them over without getting detected. I have an idea for that. I don't know how well it's going to work, but I have an idea. I just got to find four people. That was two people. I didn't even know they were standing there. I didn't see them until I got like right up on them. There's a chopper right there. Probably has four people standing around it. I'm going to look. I see the heavy. This guy... 
that guy, this guy, and that guy. So there's four people. I don't know if you can run a heavy over, though. I've never attempted that. I don't know if you can run a heavy over. I think that's the only thing about this, these, uh, this group of people. There's people over there. I see two. Ay, ay, ay. I think I'm just gonna head over to that other spot. I guess I can try to run the heavy over. Oh. Oh. How did I do that? <laughs> All I did was run the he oh the, the heavy didn't know I was there, but oh okay. Wait a minute. Hang on, 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 hang on. Let me freaking stop the vehicle. It said run four enemies over undetected. It didn't say anything about doing it all simultaneously or within a certain time range so I guess me doing these other challenges when I was running them over they were undetected or I was undetected I suppose so I guess those three counted and then when I ran that heavy over because the heavy didn't know I was coming up behind them that counted as the fourth undetected kill it's it's probably actually a really easy task to do I had it in my mind that you had to do, you had to run four people over at the same time or within a certain time limit without being detected. Because a lot of these missions or a lot of these challenges are within the same, you know, within a time limit, you know, or at the same time, blah, blah, blah. But no, you don't have to do it all at the same time. Interesting. Interesting. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and attempt to do this one kill 10 enemies without getting detected in silent mountain province in less than 60 seconds kill three enemies while detected without getting hit or missing a shot kill three enemies while hip firing with a smg in six seconds okay so kill three enemies while detected why would the panther why would you want it to be while detected i'm a panther this is a say stealth Class, you should do kill three enemies while undetected without getting hit or missing a shot, you know, something like that. But I'm already here, so I'm gonna do it with this. Uh, do it here. I'm just uh, take out anyone who might actually be a real threat, like a sniper or rocket gunners. Kill enemies while detected without getting hit or miss missing a sh wait, without getting hit or missing a shot. So I can't get hit or miss a single shot. Huh. Interesting choice. I would rather it just be without getting hit. That just makes it easier. But I think I've done this before with a different class. So it's not that big of a deal. I'm just checking to make sure there's no uh, other rocket gunners or snipers. Because those are the ones that I feel like is an actual threat to me. Oh, I need to turn my compass on, to be honest. Because I'm pretty much doing free roam, and I like to have my compass on so I can see, like, what direction I'm going. Alright, reload my weapons, just in case. Both my primary and my pistol, they seem good. Kill three enemies while I detect it without getting hit or missing a shot. I can do that. Was that? <sighs> Soldier. Uh, is that wow that was only two kills uh who was the first one <laughs> i don't know maybe it was the uh the heavy that i ran over because when i ran him over the heavy was didn't know i was there but everybody else knew i was there so technically I was detected when I ran him over and technically when you hit someone with a vehicle that that you don't miss I don't know. I'm confused about that. What? I, I just killed those two people. That was just two two kills two kills. I Don't know. Okay. Uh, yeah, okay, but killed three enemies while hip firing with a SMG in six seconds Should be pretty easy 
Should be pretty easy. I just gotta find three enemies to do. You can always flashbang, distract, do whatever. But uh, hip firing, it used to be just aim third person. That used to be considered hip firing, but I guess somewhere along the way Ubisoft changed it to that not being hip firing. Oh well, I guess. Oh damn, did not <laughs> expect a vehicle to be passing me by. Uh, I guess I'll see what I can do here. Three enemies times two, so six total. There's two right there. Oh God. Go away. There's a person. There's those two. That one. So there's two two men patrols, possibly three. But I'm trying to find the third person to try to kill. It's like any other patrol, except in the dark. I'm gonna fall asleep. I'm gonna Who, fall asleep for somebody. <sighs> Doesn't happen too. Uh, yeah, my sight is clear. I'm trying to see if there's a third like around here or something. If there is, I don't see him. All clear. Watch my back. I don't want any surprises. Okay. Got them. Just need to do it one more time. Is this guy. Ay, 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 ay. I don't mind killing this guy, but he's by himself, so it would just be a waste of a kill. There's this guy, so that'd be two if I can time it right. Oh. He saw me through... Yeah, this man saw me through this container. That's weird. It's not the first time that the enemy has spotted me through a object, though. There's definitely some type of malfunction glitch going on in this game. But here's this guy. Uh. Oh no, where did this guy go? He was supposed to be my third. Ah, oh, that son of a bitch. You sack of shit. You were supposed to be my third kill and you decided to run away. Alright, well, that base is clear. What the hell? Oh yeah, that's exactly what I need. Not too hard, not too hard, not too hard. Okay, so now kill 10 enemies without getting detected in Silent Mountain uh, in less than a minute. Silent Mountain is over here. Ay, ay, ay. Ooh, Camp Black Widow is in this province. So I could go there. I do like going to this location. Ooh, that look nice, that look nice, that look real nice. I gotta spawn in a chopper so I can fly over there. So kill 10 enemies without getting detected in Silent Mountain province in less than 60 seconds. That's actually quite easy because you can actually use your sync shots for um, three of them. And I'm actually, I'm actually going to um, show something. Um, you can use your squad teammates too. So technically, you can take down six people very easily and then just shoot like the rest of them. Someone was asking in the comment section on one of my other challenge videos asking about it. And I said you could, but then someone said that the teammates don't count. 
So I'm just going to show it in this video that it should count. I don't know. I've never used my teammates before for uh, these challenges. So this would be my first time. But I just, I believe it should work. I don't see why it wouldn't. Okay, so I'm going to get my teammates to uh, Mark Kim. Mark Kim. So that's two. Him. So that's three. Mark the heavy. So that's four. Five, six. Seven. Eight. Huh. Huh, I guess the AI teammates don't count. Because that was definitely more than... That was definitely more than ten. And I guess I shot that man through the wall. <laughs> I don't know, some of these challenges, man, I feel like they're broken. I feel like they don't register like they're supposed to. I definitely feel like the challenges are broken and they, they're not, they're definitely not registering like they're supposed to. Kill 10 enemies in one use of cloak and run. Hit four headshots with four bullets without getting detected. Kill enemies with, from more than 200 meters with a SMG. Oh, well, all that seems pretty easy. The only one that might be difficult is the cloak and run. Kill 10 enemies in one use of cloak and run. That does seem a bit difficult. Because the cloak and run does not last long. So you have about 3 to 5 seconds to kill 10 enemies in one use of cloak and run. So yeah, that, 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 that's going to be a bit tricky. Anyways, that is actually going to be it for this video. In the next one, I will be doing the rank 18. And then if I have enough time, I'll probably go ahead and do 19 and possibly even 20 but we will see so i hope everyone enjoyed this i hope everyone found some interesting information i don't think these challenges are registering correctly <laughs> but whatever they're 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 super ridiculous they're so stupid but also very easy to do anyways that's it for this video i hope everyone enjoyed click the like button if you did click the subscribe button if you want to see more awesome epic tactical and stealth content from me and as always, I hope everyone has a fantastic day.